Hello everyone, welcome back to more Pokemon Emerald, the Let's Play where I, of course, mess up a lot with grass types. In the last episode, uh, we made it to Fortune City and we also met Steven and we got a Devon scope. And by the way, I want to get down here. Uh, guess what, guys? Who's back? It's Lilo. Yes, I couldn't live without Lilo. To be honest, uh, I tried out, uh, who, what's it? Rude Cactus? She was rude. She wasn't that good. So, um, I'll think I took executive decision along with some things that my friends asked, told me. Uh, they're the ones who were like, you should use Rude Cactus. It's like, oh, I'm sorry. Well, you were wrong. Change your mind, to be fair. I changed my mind a lot. But, um, I did some things off screen. I trained a little bit. And, uh, in particular, I taught. I didn't teach Sludge Bomb. Oh, wow. Maybe I am a little out of it. But, uh, yeah, I might teach Sludge Bomb eventually to. I'm not decided yet. I was thinking either Cradley or Valaplume or Velocity or whatever it's gonna be. But yeah, we gotta get this thing out of the way. It attacked us! Oh no! If I sound a little quiet, I do apologize. I'm recording at night tonight because I don't have time right now during the daytime, which is when I usually record videos to get it rolling. And uh, yeah, that's my whole thing. Let's actually not mess up this whole um, K Lumsy strategy where you fly and then regularly rank the enemy. It changed the grass type, that's what it does. And uh, hopefully I'm not too loud, uh, my parents are still up right now. You know, people are still actually moving around. I don't want them to hear me, but um, I'm worried that I'm talking a little too quietly tonight, because uh, if I am, then that sucks, but that's the whole thing. Next two weeks, I'm going to be working uh, during the daytime, and that's just how it's going to be. I have to work at nights when it's all quiet and stuff. It's actually thunderstorms outside right now, I think. I hope I don't, you don't hear it I that either. That would also suck, to be honest. <laughs> so yeah. k Lumsy, you did it, girl! Good job. Oh yeah, k Lumsy's a girl. Is k Lumsy a girl in, um... Probably not, but... Let's see. Magical Leaf. Is that better? Kind of. It never misses, though. Um, I don't know if I use Growth that often, but, uh, I'll get rid of Growth. I don't think we need to set up right now. Uh, Magical Leaf is always good to have, you know what I mean? Yeah. I could really use Sun support for this team, to be honest with you guys, because Sun is important and we got a Nest Ball. Nice! Uh, but I say that, you know why? Because I had this planet all along! Actually, I just came up in my head, to be honest. I completely forgot. There, here's a, there's a cave over here, just floating in water, and a tree over there. Uh, we're gonna ignore that for now, but uh, in here is Scorched Slab. There's nothing really in here. It's just like a sunny rock thing, I guess. But you got Sunny Day, yes! I totally called it. I did not. I just saw it. You know, maybe I am smarter than I thought. But, uh, we're gonna keep going on. This is the Scorch Lab! And we're not gonna fight Winona yet, because I'm scared of bird types. Especially with my team. I don't want to use just, a uh, lily pad for the fight, because that's just boring. Uh, do I have a repel set up? I don't think so. Luckily, I moved the repels up here, so that, uh, they're easy access. I fought some of the trainers off screen. Uh, Gabby and Ty are no longer there, because I fought them. You're just going to wait until I run to a TV to determine what I did. But I got plans for today's episode. I'm going to show off some of the battles, uh, including this one? No, I'm not going to show... Now I'll show this one. No big deal. Let's go. I'm not afraid. Do you have any moves that can strike a flat... Well, uh, yeah, but I'm not using it, because Lilypad is overpowered. We're getting to the point of Lilypad's time. You know, I should just, like, show my... Oh, it's Colin. Are you Farf? <laughs> I think that's his name. Hopefully I don't mess that up, but uh, actually we're gonna show off the beautiful magical leaf effect. I wish the raining animations didn't take so long. That's why I hate fighting in weather in particular, because like the effects just take time. And I said I was gonna cut up battles, but uh, you know, I'm just gonna show some of them off today. Uh, maybe I shouldn't be showing myself, but there's a particular Pokemon that we haven't seen yet, I believe. And uh, that's what we're gonna talk about. Natu, yes. Natu we have not seen yet, so that's what I'm doing. I'm trying to show off Pokemon that we have not seen yet. And, uh, yeah, a lot of these trainers we have seen, but some of them we have not. If we do run into trainers that we have seen, I'm definitely going to cut their footage out of the battle. And, uh, if I do see something, I'll comment on it. And that's just how the way it's going to be, so we're going to use Ice Beam for it. <laughs> oh my god, I don't know how to talk, how loud to talk right now. I, it's first time recording at night, like I said. It's storming outside, and, uh, it's going up on Tuesday. The schedule has changed, in case you haven't noticed. Uh, I didn't forget. It's just how the way it's going to be, because I put another project on highest- Oh my god, what the heck? Which path do I take? They're all just terrible. Uh... 
Okay, Lumsy, I think that you're fine up there. Let's do this. I'm not afraid. Me, Pokemon, and my parasol. If any one of them is missing, the picture of beauty will be ruined. I think those other two I fought beforehand, uh, so I'm not too concerned about fighting the monster. I can just skip them, but we got a lovely, lovely trainer. Angelica and Lionel. Lionel? I don't know. Oh god, this is the nightmare combination. In the rain, we got Maynard Chick. Probably has thunder. I'm against K. Lumsy. You know, it's not exactly a good thing, but uh, we'll come prepared. We're gonna do it. Oh, this is what I was talking about. Cast form has certain different typings during certain types of weather. So yeah, let's try out Magical Leaf, actually, and uh, Confuse Ray on this main trick. Oh my god, here's the thunder. Please don't kill K. Lumsy. Because that would be clumsy. Oh my gosh. Oh, come on, you have it too? Are you kidding me? Jeez, K. Lumsy was not suited for this battle right now. Oh, thank- Oh, come on. We're not going to be so magical we fought this way. Yes! You did it! But that's how pretty magical it is. Oh my god, we struck it for a little bit. We're going to use Confuse Ray on this main act trick. Uh, this is going to get annoying. I'm going to switch out K-Lumsy because I don't want K-Lumsy. Uh, I'm, I'm just like messing up the words right now. Um, the rest of the trainers on the route, we have seen the Pokemon, so I think I'll skip them. And I'll try to avoid them. Um, You know what, let's give uh, Captain Toad a little time to shine. And what we're going to do is Bullet Seed the butts out of that cast form right now. Captain Toad, save the day. Mess up. Hit yourself, please. Yeah. You did it. I'm proud of you. You can't strike down a pimento bean. Why did I say pimento bean? It's an olive. It looks like a freaking olive. Yeah, spit that water drop. How do you spit it? Does the seeds grow if you hit a water droplet? These are the questions that are very important to consider. Probably not, but <laughs> to me they are. Oh uh, yeah, by the way, I have the EXP share currently on Lilo. The amulet coin, I switched over to uh, K. Lumsy, which is why I have K. Lumsy up in front. But K. Lumsy is kind of suffering right now. Be mock punch in the face. Please hit yourself. That would be very helpful. Uh, nope. Oh, come on. I don't have time to do with status effects. Oh my god. Kill it with the bullet seed. I'd be very much appreciated. Can you get a five? Let's get a five. I don't think a five is gonna do it, but let's get a five anyways. Oh, oh, the five did it! Yes, yes, I knew it. I calculated it myself. The critical hit did not matter, so don't think that I'm going crazy and stuff like that. But I, I probably am, uh, to be fair. But we're gonna keep going. Angelica and Lionel were defeated. Yeah, you completely ruined my beauty. Oh dear. I've seen your policy in action. I don't use Misty strategy. Defensive and all offensive. Use X defend, you know, like a chump. But we got a revive over here. These are very helpful. Uh, we need to cure some of these Pokemon. Do I have any paralyzed heals? I need to use some of these items. Full heals. That works well. Both of them. And uh, I also have a lot of cookies sitting here. You know, I bought the cookie just because it's cute and stuff, but it takes up a lot of space. And uh, oh yeah, we have hyper potions. Let's just use that because we can, and I don't want to scroll all the way up. You see how good I am with this game? You know, I'm like super considerate of what everyone wants. I don't remember what she has. Uh, I'm pretty sure she's a cool trainer. I want to say that. Oh gosh, nothing up here. Yes. Oh yeah. By the way, that's what we're going to cover this episode. See that bush over there? I really need secret power. Secret power. We need to cover secret bases because my secret base, my favorite location of all time, is coming up in today's episode. Yes. Lilo makes an appearance, a cameo appearance, you know, you're not the star of the show, you already had your time in the sunlight. This is all about secret bases. I tricked you by calling this episode Lilo's Revenge. What? You guys are like, Pixel, how could you do that? How could you do this to me? But we're gonna take care of this lady, because cool trainers usually have the coolest Pokemon, and uh, I have no doubts that she will as well. Normally, Jennifer has a Milo tick in the first few ga two games. Uh, Ruby and Sapphire, but she has a stable by this time. Why do I know that? Because I had to look up these trainers beforehand to know what I was getting myself into so I run into actually interesting trainers. So, uh, oh god, Vega. Mega Sableye, that's a Pokemon I want to try out to be honest. Um, I know Prankster Sableye is great, it's not in this game because Prankster is not a thing. Oh come on, it seems like it's a thing because it's really annoying right now. But, uh, yeah, Sableye is in fact, um, Pokemon I really want to try out, but at the same time, I got Omega Ruby, and Ruby does not have Sableyes, and Prankster is pretty hard to come by if you do not have that game to breed your Pokemon with. I love breeding, but uh, I'm not going to breed anything that won't come if nothing happens. You know what I mean? That sounds a little weird, but stop with the protections! I get it! 
You're annoying. You're a piece of diamond. Maybe I should cut this fight out. I'll see you guys then. By the way, cool trainers are annoying because they have full restores, which I do not- What is up here? Is there something over here? Well, I can explore because- Oh no, it's, it's a shortcut. Oh come on, I didn't realize that at all. I am dumb. I, this is the first time I actually noticed that shortcut. I gotta be honest with you. Because um, being honest is important. But well, as I was saying, they have- Oh come on. When the- Oh, when the full restore one- Full restore? No, repel. When the repel runs out, that this happens. What I was saying was the cool trainers have full restores, which is very annoying for running against, but luckily, uh, Woodchip is a boss, and, uh, Lilo actually got a level off that battle, so good job, Lilo, because, uh, yeah, I don't know. Why did, why did I use that? I don't need a high potion right now. Well, I could have used it, but I didn't want to, so, you know, let's use Super Repel. Super Repel, Super Potion, they're all the same, right? Right, so this is normally, like, a path that kind of cuts like this. And look at this rainbow, you can see the clouds. Oh my god, look at those beautiful clouds. Oh my god. I do not want to fight him right now. Um, can we skip you? I think we can. Over here we have a light ball, I'm pretty sure. Yep. Yeah, uh, no? It's a light ball in the remakes. Whatever, Hyper Potion is not as cool as a thing. But yeah, we're approaching my favorite spot in the game. As soon as we pick these berries, hello lady. This lady over here also gives berries. She's just eyeing those berries over there. She's like, yo, I'm in slow motion. I'm stuck in a frame. Those clouds are moving, but I'm not. You know, that makes a lot of sense. Oh, you're- You can finally move? Good- good job. Well, too bad. You can't. Yeah, those flowers are moving faster than you. So, I'm being mean to this berry lady. Give me a berry. The interesting thing about these berries is that it depends on your actual, uh... I think it's your number? Your lotto ID or something? Your- your trainer ID. Let's take a look at that. Um... Do I have it on here? Oh, I have it back here. So it's 29389. I think it's the last digit that determines what berry you get, but correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, but I'm probably wrong because I don't know a lot of these things off the top of my head, but uh, yeah, so look at all these cool little berries. This place just attracted me. This is my favorite spot to make a particular base, so I will definitely be doing that. As no, I don't want to paint on a berry. We're doing fucking berries all the time. You know what I mean? I wish the sky was like this, but it's like pitch black right now. Well, to be fair, it's like 10 at night. That I'm recording this. You know, I should probably be asleep right now, like a good little boy. But, uh, no. I'm just gonna be here, recording my stuff, and, uh, no one's gonna talk me out of it because I can! But, uh, as you can see, if this clump of blast can be. blast. Glove grass can be move. And we possibly go inside. It's not my list, it's just me not being able to speak properly. Uh, but what we're gonna do here, you need. And we got this a long time ago, secret power. You can actually, uh, Mostly any anyone can learn this. That's good. It's good to know. Um, who do I want to give it to? I think I'll give it to Kay Lumsey, actually. Uh, let's get rid of Stomp. Um, uh, because Stomp... They're on the same power. Um, flinching. It's not, it's not bad. Plus, Secret Power has certain special effects, so why not? It's a good- it's a step up. See, in hindsight, I could have taught him that to Lilo to get an actual attacking move besides Bullet Seed, but we're not gonna do that. We're gonna use Secret Power instead with Kay Lumsey. Discovered a small entrance. This was always my favorite place to make a base. I do want to make it here. Look at this. It's cute. It's tiny. It's just right for me. Can we decorate anything? Do we have anything to decorate? We have two dolls. Um, look at that. Look at me. Woo! Look at me slide across the screen. Da -da 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 Can't be placed on the ground. What? I don't have a desk. Well, that's dumb, actually. We got all these grass types, at least, to go in our base. So we'll get that to that at a certain point. We should probably go like the four tree. In hindsight, I didn't think we'd be getting our base this soon, although to be fair, it was right, ne right, right next to it, so I probably shouldn't have expected that, but I did. Uh, we're gonna keep moving on because, yeah, we're making some good progress right here. Yeah, this is Route 120. We've pretty much cleared everything Route 120. Uh, I think there's gonna be something coming up soon that I'm gonna show off, but uh, oh my god. Yes, let's show this. We need another double battle. We're not gonna use Kalemzy this time. Uh, yeah we are. Because they're the ones least experienced. Oh no! I messed that up. At least I can skip him. I don't want to fight him anyways. He's dumb, probably. But this is a new trainer class. This is the Hex Maniac, Tammy. Hi, Tam. Yeah, they—they're basically old cult kind of witches and stuff like that. I always thought they're kind of creepy. Uh, to be fair, they are creepy. So, hopefully, I don't remember ghost typing with. Ghost is one of those like weird typings that I'm not too familiar with. Uh, that and bug. Bug is another type that I'm not particularly familiar with in terms of how to fight against. 
it's because I don't run into those a lot. They're a lot more uh, early game bugs at least. Ghost types? I don't know. There aren't a lot of ghost types, so that's a fair fair reason not to fight them. But uh, yeah, goodbye to Skull. You were a skull that made me on the edge. And here's the other ghost type. There are two ghost types that are introduced in this generation, which was, I think it's just these two. I don't know about the two main important ones. There are probably other ghost types. Uh, maybe? Probably not, but uh, it's Shuppets. Look at the, wow. That kind of looks like a peacock feather in his eyeballs. You know, like the shade of yellow, the shade of green, and the shade of blue. I did not notice that. That's a little interesting. It's like a little butterfly wing. Maybe? I don't know. Maybe I'm just talking off my head, because that's probably what I do. They both gave me 300 EXP, so that's very nice. I have lost with my weird color hair. That kind of looks like Sora. Speaking of that, 100% orange juice still not back. Because Mario Kart is- Oh, come on! Ugh, let's see what you got. If you're nothing special, we won't see your fight, but- Oh, come on, bugs? Are you serious? Did we fight a dust tox? I don't know. I hate fighting dust tox. But we've got a flying type to do so, so let's do it! Yeah, use protect. It's meaningless. You're screwed. Oh wait, he could protect again. That's not good. I find it weird how like fly is just a big blob in the sky. You know what I mean? It's just like you turn into a blue blob, like a dummy. So Dustox has the side beam this time around, which is a little odd to me because like Butterfree usually has a side beam. Maybe it's like a moth, or I don't know. Like the venom moth has side beam. Maybe they're just creepy to look at. Yeah, we use secret power. That's the power of the crystal uh, powers. They're not crystal coconuts. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't want to hear it right now. Let's use Bully Pad to wrap this up. I think this was getting pretty much to a close at this point. What do you think? Uh, possibly? Possibly. I think I cut up one fight, but the episodes aren't particularly long because I never know how to go through it. I always say I couldn't cut these battles up, but the battles that I show are the ones that actually have Pokemon that we haven't really seen yet. So, you see my problem. You know what I mean? <laughs> oh my god. And I also won't cut up gym battles. I just, I just that's a lot of battles I won't cut up. I'll just cut up sea battles. Because no one wants to go to the ocean. That's lame. Oh my god. Oh god. She's a new trainer class, we'll deal with her next time. Hopefully, move out of the way, turn around, get on my way. Yes, thank you. Oh! Okay, we're here to move out to Mount Byer! And with that, that is our cue to go to the very next... Uh, next episode, that's next time. But see you guys then, hopefully I'll have an episode on Thursday. I haven't recorded it yet, but uh, stay tuned folks. Bye-bye now!